Are You Ready to Smile? Noodle the Pug and his human, Jonathan Graziano, are here. This lovable pug, you probably we're remember, took the internet by storm when Jonathan introduced the world to the concept of bones or no bones. This is a routine that would predict what kind of day it's going to be. We are here with a reading to find out how today is going to go. <laughs> Today's is very clear. Noodle has yet to say his first word, but I heard no. I hope you're doing so well today. We're here with a reading to find out how today's going to go. Go forth and Bones Day. <laughs> A Bones Day. Well, nearly 5 million TikTok followers later, the duo is back. A brand new children's book, Noodle and the No Bones Day. Jonathan, we're so glad to see you again. Noodle, hello. Uh, how has this been, worldwide fame? I mean, you guys have just taken off. It's been, in, it's been amazing. It's been unbelievable, and I've been straddling reality and absolute insanity for the past nine months. And Noodle has settled into it quite well. I know, Noodle's, like, <laughs> ready for celebrity life. He does. He showed up here, and he was like, this is the person who's going to help me. This is the person who's going to help her. He was ready to run the show. I know. I mean, I tried to say hi, and he referred me to his agent. Exactly. It's awkward. Exactly. He'll get back to you in three weeks. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's talk about it because you guys have a new children's book. It's so cute. Bones or no bones day. Tell me what the message is. What's the concept of here? Course. So thank you. First of all, thank you so much for having us. We're so excited to be here. The the book is really a uh, just a, a, a product of the TikTok and the message of our TikTok. And essentially what it is, is it's a story about Noodle going about his day as a normal dog. And then I encounter the very first no bones day. So it's the book is all about me figuring out that you know, not only is it important for me to listen to Noodle when he, you know, he does or does not want to do something, but that it's okay to let people know when you need to have either a personal day or you're ready to kind of go out in the world. It's a really wonderful book that's just really about communicating how you're feeling. Yeah, and self-care, the illustrations are adorable. Amazing. And this does give us a smile, but it's actually, it's sweet. I mean, a no bones day, you know, there's some days where you just kind of want to hide out in your bed. Absolutely, and self-care is such an, it's such an important topic and it's been so relevant for a while, but you know, when I was, you know, I'm 31 years old and I'm still kind of new to the self-care idea. So the idea <laughs> that we can, introduce it in a children's book and frame it in this way. I, I, it's just wonderful to see that this has really made an impact on people. Now, how is Noodle doing? Because he's going to be 14 in July. 14 on the 4th of July. 14 oh, on the, the Great American Pug. He's doing great. He's truly living his best life right now. We just we had a black car take us down here, and we're going to have a black car take us home. He's, he's living his best he life right now. He doesn't need to have bone stays anymore because no, everyone's doing everything Exactly. We can, carry, we can carry him around everywhere. You said even his food is getting better. Oh, my God. Let me tell you, the concierge New York City City he's he's a celebrity a veteran, doctors, veterinarians. All of it. Oh, all of it. Noodle's gotten calls. Ah. Me... <laughs> I know, I know. Don't worry. We'll, won't be late okay, for your next so what, appointment. Should we just do it? I mean, oh, we, we got to find out if we're having a bone or no bone. And there's no banquet table of cheese this time. I know. So we just we we'll made it harder. See. Okay, okay. Let's okay. see. You ready? Oh, we did a poll, by the way, before oh, we you did. did? This. Yeah, what we you said, think? is it going to be a bones or no bones day? Poll results 60% pre predicted bones day. Predicted bones. Let's see. No pressure, Noodle. All right, Noodle, ready? Three, two, one. Those are bones. Those are bones, bones right oh, yeah. there. I see the strong. Look at yes. that. So strong. So, so sturdy. So strong, Noodle. You ready to rock? You did so good, Noodle. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Just go on and take take on the day. You've I already know. seen a velociraptor. Carpe You've got a new Diaz. book. I know. He took on that raptor. No problem, Not man. even scared. No, he sneezed on it. that squawking bark that he does. <laughs> so threatening. He learned it from the dinosaurs, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Noodle and Jonathan, always a delight. Thank you so much. Congrats on the book. It's called Noodle and the No Bones Day, and it is out now. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.